Okay. It's actually kind of okay, because I was about to spend the next 15 minutes making platforms and not remembering that um, my boots just walk up. <clears throat> All right, so, you know, silver lining, it's cool, it's fine. <clears throat> oh. Apparently that's a temporary situation. We should probably make something a bit more permanent. Okay, but we can also just use the stuff we have here. We don't need necessarily need a platform. It evened out pretty low, so. Yeah, we can just use this stuff. Let's see. Oh, it's still not fast enough with run. I was one day I'm gonna be able to hold this down and hold A and it's just gonna constantly put it down in front of me. Oh no, what's going on here? Why can't I place more? Is the lava too high? The lava is still moving? Okay, I can do it, I, can, I mean I can do it a little higher, it's fine. We're gonna do this little platform here. There are accessories and potions that increase block placement speed and distance. Yep. I am using uh, one of the better ones right now, the Hand of Creation. You can see that on the right side of the screen. I'm also using a set called Reaver, which does that as well. And um, yeah. Mm-hmm. But even then, apparently it's not fast enough to do full bore, if you will. Okay, now I don't know how this is gonna work, but I think it'd be pretty fun if we all find out together how much this is gonna be ridiculous. Also, I just realized I mined 2,700 hellstone when I cleared this area. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Um, wow. Is Ko winning? You don't really win in Calamity. It just hurts a little less sometimes. Yeah. Um, but right now, right now, it's not hurting that bad at all. We've had an excellent, excellent day in this game. I mean, we beat Moon Lord, made huge upgrades. We're making, we've already killed like three bosses into the next tier. Like it's been, it's been a ri Considering I've spent hours on bosses, literally hours on single bosses, um, today's been a really good day. A really good day. Yep. No question. It's been a freaking awesome day. I don't know if this is big enough, y'all. good man awesome that was pretty good that worked out pretty well <laughs> that was great uh let's do you profaned rock okay 
Let's see if we got lucky enough. We may have to do that again, or at least try it again. Uh, is there any DF tomorrow? Uh, actually, is is there a DF tomorrow? I thought there was going to be, but then maybe it got canceled. Um, hmm. Oh, JP's away this weekend. Oh, chat, are you telling me we're just going to have to play more Terraria tomorrow? Fine. If we have to. Um, if we have to, I'll, I will, I will buckle down and I will do what I have to do. Oh, that's it. That's the thing we wanted right there. It, it didn't even like drop in a bag. It just like actually dropped. Oh, it's awesome. All right. Hold on. Um, so this will replace you. Okay, dude. Nice little upgrade. Mm -mm. Okay, so we're gonna open you. Five platinum, damn. That girl was loaded. I stole all her money, this feels kind of bad. Uh, we're not gonna do the parry thing. Don't need a bow. And I think we got what we needed off her, so I don't need to kill her again. Do I have time to try another boss? Maybe like one try. Who are we looking at though? Uh, we killed the dragon folly. Do we need to farm anything off the dragon folly? Mm. Whoa, that thing looks pretty cool. Sword swarm? I don't know what that means, but that sounds fun. Uh, looks like we got anything major we needed. We may have to get more of this, but that's for later. I don't know if we needed anything immediately. Oh, oh wait, actually. No, we do need... We need to kill the poltergast guy before we can do anything with this guy, I think. What's Silva? Silva Horned? Planty Mush. Ascendant Spirit Essence. There's so many different items, it's hard to keep track of what the hell is what. It doesn't... Rob? Okay, that drops in the dungeon. Nope. I got no idea what any of this stuff is. That that has to be endgame, right? That has to be endgame. Okay. New crafted summon as well, Virid Vanguard. Oh. Oh. You know what? I'm going to be honest. Here's the thing. Unless, okay, there there is clearly a class of summon in this game, and I'm going to make this and check it out anyway. But there is clearly a class of summon in this game that is like orbits around you and does stuff, right? Like this stuff. I have yet to find a single one of these that is worth the fact that that stuff is always on the screen. Oh, now this one actually, wait, this one actually rip, whips out and hits people. That's cool. The ones that bother me, the ones that just constantly rotate around your character because it becomes so hard to see like other projectiles when they're near you. So this seems pretty cool though. But I mean, what I, what I want to use this over this, I mean, this thing hits for... 300 damage this sits for even if we buff it up it's gonna be like 170 ish right so why would i want to use this over this people are saying trust is good i will i mean i, I trust you <laughs> but it's better you know okay you know what let's try it i'm gonna stop i'm gonna stop okay no we're gonna try this 
enough conjecture. Let's try this. And if we're going to do it, let's do it right. Let's make it... Uh, oh, it's mythical. Shoot. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, we'll pop you there temporarily. Let's do this. Okay. Let's grab our dummy. Let's do this. What we're working with with this one is this. Okay. You gotta give it a second to catch up. Homework, appreciate it, man. Welcome to our community, buddy. Okay. So this is sticking right at around 120, or, or 12. Uh, well, actually, hold on, what's it doing? Oh, 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 no, stop it, get out of here. Right around 12,000. So let's check this out. Set a reset. I'm not seeing it, man. I'm not seeing it. I'm, I'm not, I'm not seeing it. So again, what we're looking at right here for anyone wondering is this, this number up here, in the very top right, is the damage per second. Right now I max summon blades and you can see it's bouncing between like 6,000 and like 7,000. I think it hit eight once. Now, if I go to this, we just cleared the summon. So you can see the DPS is going down. This is, this is my armor guy. This is my other summon. I feel like that's just exponentially better. I don't see any reason why I wouldn't use just those. Okay. The reason Vivid is good is you can spam summon and their attack timer is reset on summon. I'm, I'm holding down the button right now. I'm at, well, I'm out of mana. Hold on. Not mana. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. All right. Yep. We're just going to stick with these. Mm-hmm. It says right-click to kill all super dummies, but that never works for me. Do I have to have it, like, equipped? Is that what it is? Ah, that's what it is. Okay. There we go. All right. So, I was probably supposed to go, like, ten minutes ago. So, what's our next boss? That being so. Uh, Ceaseless Void. Use this in the... Oh, this is the Rune of Kos. Okay. So, we have to use that in the dungeon? The dungeon? The hell am I going to use that in the dungeon? Do I have to like make a giant arena? I guess I do. Oh, weird. Okay. Space boss is cooler. Hmm. Oh, there is a big arena in the dungeon. Oh, is that it? Okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, so we fight him in here? Okay. So 
Let's go make this thing. Oh wait, we already have it. What am I saying? And now we just go right in. Clearly I need more beer. Seriously, let me fall past the thing? Oh, there we go. Man, y'all almost let me fall right by it. Come on, guys. Try to get with it. If I'm gonna fall by, I need to yell. At least, like, notify me somehow. If you yell loud enough, I might hear you. Okay. What are... Oh. Ooh. Do we have necro... Necroplasm? Max mana? That's good. Oh, we need this for the Devour of the Gods. Interesting. One magic damage. Hold your mouse. Wait, 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 and put your trust in the power of blue magic? Oh, it's a Poltergast summon. We need 50. Oh, damn. Okay. Uh, a melee thing. Alright, cool. Anyway. Okay. Let's do this. I think we're gonna be in the dungeon for a while for this, uh... Yeah, necroplasm summon. Let's see what this thing is. There's no, are there no fast projectiles? Can we use our mountain here? Dude, I totally think we could use our mountain there. I think a glow stick killed you? Yeah. Hmm. What do you guys recommend? Should we, should we put like platforms in to help dodge or what do you think? My wow, a lot of people in chat like my least favorite boss. Damn, that bad, huh? Jeez. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's put you here for now. I need to get my wish thing back, yeah. Dang, dude. This music is amazing, but this boss seems like it's gonna be real hard. Tons and tons and tons of moving parts all the time. Um, hmm. Hmm. Okay, first of all, let's get the witch's broom back out. It's, I keep coming back to the fact that I, I feel like there needs to be something better than this witch's broom available to me right now. Chad, is, you guys are pretty adamant there isn't, right? You can use cost in space or underworld too. Okay. You can make the brim rose? What do you mean, Miss Friend? Here we go. 
Brimrose is the best post prov mount, I believe. Oh, oh, well, I don't even know what Brimrose is. Okay, I'll take a look at this. Uh, take a look at that after this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Hey, um, so tell me real quick, as a summoner, do you guys think I should use summons or just ignore them? Uh, what, what, is, what does chat recommend? What do you guys think? Should I summon my summons before I do boss fights or should I just use my whip? Should we pull chat? What do you guys think? Okay. <clears throat> I'll do a, I'll do a, a Twitter poll tomorrow and we'll see what, see what, we'll see what everyone thinks. Summons are mid-tier gameplay. I agree. I agree. Thankfully, this whole channel is mid-tier, so it lines up pretty well. We like to manage expectations here. Don't want to get too flashy with it. Consistency. Consistency is key. Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. All about consistency, Jeff. Okay. Let's try it this time. We're gonna do the same thing. A little bit less suck this time. I feel like we can just kind of chill here until they move in, and then we just gotta kind of get out. Now, I'm not really sure what we're doing on this one. Do I just avoid that? I think. Oh god. Okay. Okay. So, and this is this is kind of this is a very interesting fight. I feel like we're we're not supposed to move for a lot of it until we really like absolutely have to. There's a lot on the screen. Yeah. yeah. This 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 is yet another one of those fights in Calamity that's a little unique, where you kind of have to puzzle through what it is as opposed to like the best way to do a boss fight. Oh, the guide recommends doing this boss later. You really should be using Terragon instead. Terragon, what's Terragon? It's got phases where you can't damage it and you just have to survive the attack. Oh man. Oh, the Terragon armor? Wait, what? No, I, th I thought we agreed that was a no-go. Didn't, didn't we say that was not what we wanted to do? I, I, I don't know. Oh, here we go. I'm the wrong thing. <clears throat> That's weird. I thought it was... Oh, Tara. I'm sorry. There it is. Yeah, I thought I thought we said this is not very good. I think I'm gonna stay stick to Stardust for now. I think our next uh, upgrade is gonna be the blood, whatever. Yeah, oh my lord. Okay. Um, so if we're gonna wait to do him later, I don't know what we would get to really make that better. What do you guys think? Should we come back to him later or should we just keep trying him now? Do the other two KOS bosses first. Okay, okay. So what, what are the other two KOS bosses? Oh. User are going to cost high in space. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay. Um. Let's try this guy. How fun, dude. Same item, too. That's cool.
Okay. Uh, oh, is my thing full? Uh, let's see. I think that was a big. Nice. This is hardcore. Uh, this is Master Mode Revengeance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Okay. So that was kind of cool. Oh, whoops. Oh. Okay, we're going to deposit all of this. Go to bag. Bag of... Grab this. Spectral Veil. No, that's a rogue thing. It's a rogue thing. Twisting Nether. Oh. Status is void stash? Oh, that's much later. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, what is this? Um, <clears throat> oh, hi. Weak my ass. Get over here. What is this thing? Uh... Is it one or two? Oh, it's two! What in the hell is this? Are they good? Please tell me they're good. Are they good? Are they good? Hold on. Oh, we gotta test these immediately. Please be good. This is so cool. Please be good. <laughs> okay. All right. They're uh, they're doing okay. They're doing okay. It's a little dragon party. It is a little dragon party. It is. Okay. More fun to play with tomorrow. Damn. The amount of progress today, chat. This this will go in the annals of history. I know I'm on the wrong side of the screen. I don't care. Um, as one of the best days of progress in a game of this type probably ever it was amazing anyway thank you so much for being here have a great one i appreciate y'all and your time uh tomorrow morning is sunday so i'm gonna hang out with my family in the morning but i will be on in the afternoon and since there's no drop frames i will probably stream something all afternoon maybe do some of this i'd love to play some more knock on the coffin lid uh maybe some seven days to die i don't know but it's gonna be good and I hope to, uh, to see you here for it. So have a great rest of your night. Thanks for being here and catch you later. Bye-bye.